Hello students. Today our topic is Once Upon a Time. Chapter 22 GK Class 5. You must have heard about famous proverb, Time flies over our head but leaves behind its shadow. Let's learn about some ancient clothes. First of all, we will talk about sundial. It uses the moving shadow of the sun to tell time. The shadow of the thin road placed at the center falls on the lines of the disc. That indicates the hour of the day. You can see here in this clock there is a shadow and due to this shadow we can get the time that is 2 o'clock. So amazing it is that world largest sundial is in India and its name is Samrat Yantra. Samrat Yantra, the largest sundial in the world, is located at Jantar Mantar in Jaipur, India. It is 90 feet high and can tell the time with an accuracy of 2 seconds. The shadow moves at a speed of 1 mm millimeter per second. There is a small cupola on the top. The information about eclipses and arrival of monsoons were announced from there. So this was used to tell the announcement of monsoons and eclipses. The other famous sundial in India is Konak sundial that is in Orisha. Next type of ancient clock is hourglass. It is made of two connecting glass bulbs. It is filled with sand that takes an hour to pass from the upper to the lower bulb. Once it is drained, it has to be turned over. It means when the, this process is complete, one hour is complete. Next type of clock is water clock. Water moves the wheel of the clock and drips into a container at regular intervals. You can see here in this picture also. Water is supplied through this pipe and it is dripping into this container at regular intervals. When the level goes up, the floating road fixed to the wheel rises. So when the level rises, this is the floating road and it rises. When it rises, the wheel turns through this gear transfer stick. And because of this gear transfer stick, it changes the hands of the clock. And this way we get the time. Next type of clock is candle clock. When there was no clock, candle clock were used that burned at a set amount of hours. If you want an alarm, you push the nail at the desired time length in the candle. And when it melted to that point, the nail would fall and clank on the metal holder alerting you. A unique clock that is astronomical clock. It gives astronomical information in addition to time of day. For example, location of the sun and the moon in the sky. It tells us about the location of the sun and moon in the sky. Age and phase of the moon. What is the phase of the moon in the sky? And what is the age means how many days has passed of the moon? Position of the sun, etc. So it is very important clock. I hope you understood the concept of ancient clocks very well. Thank you. Have a nice day.